Mom. Mom. <laughs> the Parkers seem to have it all. A good marriage, great kids, and a nice home. That was until the new neighbors moved in and added a little spice. Kevin Spacey and Rebecca Miller star as the Otises, Sorry, a freewheeling couple who I'm try to influence the straight-laced Parkers, played by Kevin Klein and Mary Elizabeth Mastrantonio, to completely loosen up. Familiarity is a lovely thing, and we all need it to, to kind of get on in life and make us feel secure. But at the same time, I think they've lost sight of a lot of things. They haven't addressed a lot of the more personal elements of their relationship. On foursome, it's all fun and games for a while, until Richard wants to take their friendship one step further. You want to make love to my wife, but you're afraid you'll get caught. This is how you die, step by step. These little things you deny yourself. Playing denial is, is, is interesting because that's 90% of, uh, of the way most people express themselves. Not in coming out and telling you who they are, but in denying. A little wife swapping does occur, and it's far from a harmless affair. What started out as an experimental, passion-filled detour leads to a deadly twist in the plot. Samples taken from the victim's body prove you had sex with her, and the murder weapon had your prints on it. You have to help me understand this, Richard. Please, help me. I didn't kill her. In the classic Hitchcock um, mode, it's a great thriller about the wrong man accused of something that he didn't do. The script is basically built like a nightmare dream um, in which you have the desired object and then y you have the punishment for that, for, for fulfilling the desire. And the punishment could very well lead to the destruction of a family, a scenario that surely makes this man wish he had never coveted his neighbor's wife.